So hello everybody, welcome back to another video. Hope you're all doing really well. So today is gonna be my weekend top-up shop. So it's Friday and most Fridays I like to stock up for the weekend. Um, I'm gonna go to Aldi fell in love with Aldi recently and especially because the one near me has been like renovated really like pimped up and it is so nice so nice and clean and fresh and everything's all so tidy it's really it's a pleasant experience shopping in there so I'm going to go to that one um I'll show you like how it's been done up and everything so there's quite a few bits I need to get um, need to stock up on a few things and I always like to do that on a Friday if I can to stock up for the weekend so I don't have to go shopping at the weekend. So come with me to Aldi to do my weekend top up shop and then of course I will show you what I get when I get back. Let's go to Aldi. Okay, so I am back. I have laid everything out for you, sort of in the right compartments, segments. You know what I mean. So let's get into my weekend top-up shop. So let's start with the basics. First of all, we have milk. We have four pints of semi-skimmed and four pints of full fat. Semi-skimmed is for me. I always have that. Atticus always has full fat. Um, we get through so much milk in this house. I am literally buying milk every day so we've already got some in the fridge so I got another um, four pints each for the weekend so I don't have to go to the shops so right um, like vegetables fruit here I've already got loads in the fridge but there were some things that I needed to go with different meals or whatever so we've got the sweet and crispy salad um, it looks like this has got lettuce peppers um carrots has it got a bit of red onion not sure with mayonnaise dressing that looks really good i'm gonna do some i'll show you in a minute i'm gonna do some burgers i think tomorrow night I've got some pesto pasta absolutely love pesto one of my favorites i got some british basil that's to go on things like pasta when we have spaghetti bolognese things like that add a bit more flavor i um, got some piccolo tomatoes these are really nice absolutely gorgeous tomatoes i got my favorite baby cucumbers love these get through these very quickly um, sweet corn for us both. We both love sweet corn. I got some wonky raspberries. Didn't get any strawberries um, simply because we are going strawberry picking tomorrow and I know we're going to get loads there. So that's the reason I didn't get strawberries. Um, a treat for me, I actually got, it's the first time I saw these um, in a shop um, this season. I got myself some sunflowers. How beautiful. And what a fab price. 
£3.79. That is so good. I think I'm going to put them in the middle of the um, kitchen table. Love them. And then I saw these. I hadn't seen these before. You know, you know how much I love my coffee. These are right up my street. If you box pralines, um, you've got espresso, cafe latte and cappuccino. Dark milk and caramel white chocolate pralines with coffee filling. Yummy. I think I'm going to really enjoy them. And I think they're only about 3 99 something like that. It's a little treat for me over the weekend. I picked up one of these. They have these in quite regularly. Um, they're the Lacura, which is their beauty range. Um, reusable self-tan tanning mitt. Um, I think it's about £2 something, which is cheaper than, you know, quite a few of them. Um, so I thought I'd get one of them to keep in the cupboard. Right, over here. We have coffee beans. These are fab. I'm just a bit damp from the ice cubes. These are fab. Um, I've started having the number four strength Italian ones. You know, they're such good value. I think they're about like two pounds something, no more than three pounds. And they're a really good coffee bean, really lovely flavour. So really liking them. I got another bag of ice cubes because it's just super hot. We're going to have a super hot weekend. I think it's going to be like 27, 28, even 29. So um, I've got a few in the freezer, but I thought I'd get another bag. We have another tub of Atticus's favourite ice cream. He absolutely loves this one. Then I got some plain waffle cones, um, obviously to go with the ice cream. Um, this is new in. I saw this now. I love my cheese. Absolutely love my cheese. And um, this is the British cheese selection. In here, we've got mature cheddar, double Gloucester with Poquito pepper, red Leicester, and Wensleydale with cranberries, which is one of my favourites. Um, so I thought they're going to go down lovely with crackers. And I've got this cheese for Atticus because Atticus loves he loves his cheese toasties, and he doesn't like strong cheese. He just wants plain, the mildest cheese. So I got him these ones for his cheese toasties over the weekend. Then we have some British lean beef steak mince, 5% fat. That's for a spag bowl. Um, then I got, these are the burgers I was talking about. Some caramelised red onion and red Leicester beef burgers. How good do they sound? On Good Housekeeping Institute, taste approved, 2023. So looking forward to trying them. Also got some of their sushi. Their sushi is so good and such great value. Um, this little pack, which I like to get, is like 99p. I got the smoked salmon. It is so good. Then I got, these are doing, um, some bruschetta, delicately toasted, delicious and light snack breads with garlic and parsley. They sound really good. I love my little, like, savoury snacks and things like that. Um, then I got some of these. I guess these are, um, like the Cadbury's, what are they called? The Cadbury's brunch bars. So munchy bars, chopped chip, oat flakes, whole wheat flakes, chopped chip, a drizzle of honey and dipped in milk chocolate. Now, just here are um, four or five things that I did pop in Tesco for, which I will show you in a minute after I've been to Aldi's because there are some things you can't get in Aldi. So I got my Diet Coke. Um, this is such good value. This is like 40 odd P. Um, and to be honest, the only time I really drink Coke is with my dinner at night and I have the tiniest amount. Um, so this just works out more economical, you know, uh, just a cheaper option and it tastes fine for me um i got a pack of the classic whole grain rice i got some wiltshire cured ham slices atticus loves his ham i got some seeded brioche burger rolls for the burgers that i showed you and some tortilla wraps then if we go over here Right, sort of like cleany bit, bits that I needed to top up on for the weekend. Um, so we've got some cling film. I did want some um, tin foil, but they didn't have any in. I got this for the hallway because um, when I do my deep clean, um, probably on Sunday, because a very tiny amount left in the one in the hallway at the minute. Um, this is the wood sage and sea salt, which is obviously a dupe of the um, Joe Malone scent. Um, I found their rediffusers pretty strong. They're not bad for the price, um, and they're three. I think they're three pounds something. So I thought I'll try that one for the hallway. We've got some tissues because we're out of tissues. Um, also got some ten heavy duty black bags because I literally have not got one black bag in the house. I used the very last one yesterday, so desperately needed. I've got three packs of the toilet tissue wipes, some napkins. These are for like Atticus's pat lunch. Um, we've got some baby wipes. Then we. We've got a pack of surface wipes um, just to keep mine topped up 
And then over here, the things that I popped into um, Tesco for, which obviously I didn't see in Aldi, but there are in Aldi, but I'll explain. Okay, so I got my Arctic coffee, cold coffee, cafe latte. Um, this, now I did look at the cold coffee um, cups in Aldi, which are in the like um, takeaway section, but I saw they didn't have any straws with their cold coffee cups. I don't know if they had them separate or whatever, I don't know. So I didn't bother with them. Um, so I thought I'll just stick to this. I do absolutely love this coffee. And it was on club car price as well for I think £1.90 something. So I love that with lots of ice. Um, I got the Dolmio chunky mushroom bolognese sauce um, because Atticus is pretty fussy about his bolognese sauce. I did try once. I think I tried, was it Lloyd Grossman? So he noticed straight away. So I thought, I just can't be doing with, I just might as well get Dolmio from the off-go. It's gone up in price, isn't it? I think it's about £2.50. Um, so I got that. Got two bags of spaghetti because I couldn't see no fresh spaghetti in Aldi. So I got two bags, so we've got plenty in. And I got two of the classic garlic breads from um, Tesco because these are literally, they're 37 pence each. They're so tasty. Atticus loves them. That was my weekend top-up shop at Aldi and a few bits from Tesco. Um, so yeah, hopefully I shouldn't have to go out and get any food over the weekend. Um, so I hope you enjoyed and I will see you soon for another video. Bye.